So this book is about serial killers. <laughs> um, this is kind of the book that I read when I want to get inspiration on how to write in the mind of a serial killer. <laughs> Uh, my name is Andrew Meekle and I'm a writer, director, and producer. I own my own film company called Meekle Productions. Ever since I was in grade 8, I'd been, I'd been writing scripts. So when I was sitting in math class, or if I was sitting in science class and you saw me writing, the teacher thought I was taking notes, but I was writing the next screenplay that I was going to put in my binder. Um, it's just been something I've always done. So I applied to the Toronto Media and Film College here in Toronto. So then I left Niagara and came here. And I was supposed to start there the following September, but they ended up canceling the program. I just said, you know what, I'm going to do my own thing. I'm going to put together my own films and just teach myself. And I went online and I typed in Google how to write a proper screenplay. And it gave me this book. I just printed it out and I studied it. And then here we are. <laughs> right here. Yeah. Doing it on your own is the best way to learn because you learn as you're going. This movie right behind me, uh, Scream, right here. It's just the movie that's never been done before, Scream. Like when Scream came out, it sort of it challenged horror films because it made fun of them. It was like a film that made fun of horror films while being a horror film itself. Uh, my favorite director would have to be Wes Craven. Um, he's, again, he was a part of the Scream films. I would probably say to him to put me on the next screen film. <laughs> As a writer, you have control over what that person is feeling when they're watching the film. Just to be a writer and to have that power and just being like, ha ha, I know what's gonna happen, or like, you'll never guess what's gonna happen next, like you have control over what over what's gonna happen. Yeah, <laughs> I guess I guess so. I, I guess in the end that's what it is. try a little bit of everything just because um, the plan is eventually to go out to LA one day <laughs> and sort of try it out there. So I wanna have I wanna have a bunch of films underneath my belt before I actually try and go out there. So I wanna have a variety to show them that I can do just more than just a horror film. My motivation comes from my drive to get my ideas on screen because I feel like everything that I've written so far has been original and I want to do it before anyone else gets a chance to do it um, because there's not a lot of original horror movies nowadays or movies in general there's a lot of remakes and, and a lot of prequels and stuff so I feel like we need a generation of all new original fresh new ideas for people to sort of go and watch. <laughs> I want to I want to get to all the films first. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>